Well, hi there. Have you seen this uh, mem circulating on Facebook or anywhere else? Uh, it tells us that if we were to privatise the NHS, then our uh, hospital stays and cost of operations or anything would go through the ceiling. And as you can see, apparently in the US, a stay in the, their privatised healthcare system is going to cost you uh, over $15,000 for six days. Uh, and if you work that out in uh, UK pounds, that's like over 1,800 pounds. That's 1,800 pounds per day. And, of course, that sounds absolutely ridiculous. It's an absurd sum of money to, to be provided the bed in a sort of uh, clean conditions in a hospital. And, yeah, your initial reaction to that, that's absurd, is quite correct. And what does it cost to stay in the NHS bed? Well, it's much cheaper. It's like £400. So, obviously, this kind of looks like a good argument. We've got the 1800 versus the 400 of the NHS. So we're talking about four and a half um, times cheaper. Um, so maybe the MEM's right. Maybe we shouldn't privatise the NHS and maybe the American system uh, run by corporations is a bad idea. And with that, I'd quite agree. But there's a little bit of a fly in the ointment of this argument. And that is that the American healthcare system is very highly regulated and uh, it's a system, a legal system, where there's a culture of, of litigation and high payouts whenever there's problems. Uh, so that's that's all stuff really to do with the government. You see, the American healthcare system is a bit like uh, the NHS on steroids um, with added shareholders. Uh, so actually, it's not a valid comparison. Uh, if you want to look at a, a more sensible comparison, let's look at the cost of a private stay in a UK hospital. And uh, here we have it. Um, according to Net Doctor, it's about £275 per night. A substantial saving on the cost of an NHS bed. And, um, you know, all the money that's wasted on the hospital bureaucracy in the NHS is money that could be sent, uh, spent on giving people uh, better health care or, you know, on something else or whatever. So there you go. It's a silly mem, uh, misleading. It's uh, false propaganda. And privatising the health service would undoubtedly substantially reduce the costs and allow more health care to be delivered because pointless bureaucracy would be eliminated. Thanks for listening. Bye.